I want to talk to you today about how your words become your reality. You are where you are today in part because of what you've been saying about yourself. Words are like seeds. When you speak something out, you give life to what you're saying. If you continue to say it, eventually that can become a reality. Whether you realize it or not, you are prophesying your future. And this is great when we're saying things like, I'm blessed, I'm strong, I will accomplish my dreams, I'm coming out of debt. That's not just being positive, you are prophesying victory, prophesying success, prophesying new levels. Your life will move in the direction of your words. But too many people go around prophesying just the opposite. I never get any good breaks. I'll never get back in shape. Business is slow. I'll probably get laid off. Flu season is here. I always get it. They don't realize they are prophesying defeat. It's just like they're calling in bad breaks, mediocrity, lack. Many people don't realize with their words, they're cursing their future. Every time you say, I never get any good breaks, you just cursed your life. I'll never be able to afford that nice house. I'll never break this addiction. I'll never meet the right person. No, stop cursing your future. Sometimes the enemy doesn't have to defeat us. We defeat ourselves. Pay attention to what you're saying. Are you blessing your life or are you cursing it? I had a classmate in high school that was always very negative. Every time I asked him what was going on, he had this standard answer. He would always say, not much. I'm just getting old, fat, and bald. I heard him say that probably 500 times. I know he's just kind of kidding, but I wouldn't kid about that. He was one of the stars on our football team, always in great shape, had this thick curly hair. About 15 years later, I ran into him at the mall. When I saw him, I nearly passed out. He had prophesied his future. He looked old, fat, and bald. Friends, don't speak that defeat over your life. Our attitude should be, I'm getting younger. I'm getting stronger, healthier, better looking. I'm gonna keep my hair. I'm gonna stay in my right mind. I'm gonna live a long, productive life. Don't go around cursing your future. Start blessing your life. Prophesy good things. There's a young lady on staff here. Every morning before she leaves the house, she looks in the mirror and says, girl, you're looking good today. I saw her one time and asked if she was still doing it. She said, yeah, in fact, today when I looked in the mirror, I said, girl, some days you look good, but today you look really good. Why don't you stop criticizing yourself, talking about all the things you don't like, how you're getting too old and too wrinkled, too this, too that. Stop cursing your life and start blessing your life. Start calling yourself healthy, strong, talented, beautiful, young. Every morning before you leave the house, look in the mirror and say, good morning, you good looking thing. Are you going in the right direction? Are you seeing increase, favor, new growth? If not, check up on what you're saying. When you get your words going in the right direction, your life will go in the right direction. Make this decision with me. No more words of lack, defeat, can't do it, mediocrity, doubt. Don't curse your future, bless your future. If you'll start prophesying victory, prophesying favor, I believe and declare you're going to rise higher, overcome every obstacle, and become everything. I'm talking to you. Yes, you. Hello. Yes, I'm talking to you. Now that I've got your attention, I want you to know that I think you are awesome. And I don't mean just like a little bit awesome. You are like the Mount Everest of awesome. You're, I'm talking like ill, chill, wicked, tight, sick, stupid, over the top, hot as ice kind of awesome. And that is you, my friend. You are awesome. We don't tell each other enough how much we appreciate each other. And I appreciate you. You are awesome. So 